Hello YouTube, Boss Rino, welcome to my channel. Eto, eto, marami na request ito. Uh, kahit eto yung may copyright ang music, titirahin natin ito dahil dami na yung request. Tooks Top 5, napakaganda nito. Boses pa lang nito, natatakot na ako. So, Top 5 Scary Ghost Video, prepare to be terrified. So, inu inumpisahan ko na sa 4 kasi yung 5 na napanood ko na. Po, sa 4 tayo, mag-uumpisa. So, ito, tirahin natin ito bago pa tirahin ang iba. It looks back. Over on the channel, RX Files explore Indonesian paranormal investigator Chu does a live solo investigation of the infamously haunted Taiyu Hospital on the Indonesian island of Java. Parang sikat tong hospital na to. Lagi itong pinupunta ng mga ghost hunter. Java. Taiyu Hospital was built way back in 1933. And over its 80-year history, it began to develop a very bizarre reputation. Many patients who were treated at Taiyu Hospital claimed to see the ghostly figure of an old nurse roaming its hallways. They also said that they had seen the terrifying apparitions of patients who had passed away inside the old hospital. And some even claimed to experience horrible hallucinations, like bloody footprints running up the walls that no one else could see. Taiyu Hospital closed its doors in 2015 and has been left abandoned ever since. Oh my god! Paranormal investigator Chu is completely alone with nothing but a flashlight and his phone as he broadcasts his investigation live to his streaming audience. As Chu roams the hospital grounds, he starts to hear a few strange sounds here and there, but it doesn't seem to bother him. But then, Chu begins to ask that the alleged spirits that haunt the hospital let him know that they are there. And this is when things start to get creepy. Para na iyak na siya. Sudah, suara-suara saja. Tunjukkan semua ejakulasi kalau memang kalian ada di sini. Lingkau. Wow. Wow. Ay, sinusundan siya. hospital stretcher moves by itself, frightening Chu so much that he begins to shake uncontrollably. But things are about to get much worse. Chu decides that he's had enough of the outdoors and heads inside to explore the hospital's halls and rooms. But he starts to hear the disturbing sound of a bell ringing from somewhere inside the building. When he looks for the source, something happens that shocks him to his core. The exit door slams shut right behind him and an ominous voice can be heard. But most terrifying of all, something seems to quickly peek out at Chu from inside one of the hospital rooms. Chu is terrified and quickly heads for another section of the hospital. But as Chu continues to explore, things just seem to get worse and worse. Chu jumps when he suddenly sees what appears to be the eerie apparition of a girl standing just inside an empty storage room. Gathering all of his courage, he charges toward the creepy figure. But it disappears into thin air. Chu is now seriously freaked out and just wants to leave. But his live audience has other ideas. Boom. He gets bombarded with requests in his live chat to go back inside the hospital just one more time and explore some of the abandoned rooms. As you might guess, it did not go well. Oh my goodness, ito na. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Saya nak cuba enggak enak teman-teman di sini. Astaghfirullahalazim ya Allah. Astaghfirullahalazim ya Allah. Wow. Ito na naman yung babae sa bulutan mo, sa bulutan mo. Chu 
Pikachu freezes when he spots a woman in what looks like a hospital gown sitting on a bed inside one of the hospital rooms. She doesn't move, but her head seems to drop backwards to look at Chu as if it's not attached to her body. And with that, Chu has had enough. He ends his live stream and just gets out of there. So what do you think is going on here? Could the hospital really be haunted? Either way, real or not, whatever that is, is absolutely terrifying. Gagi, ang ganda nito. Actually, yung hospital, sobrang creepy ng itsura niya. Piling ko haunted talaga eh. Gagong galot lapit nito. The weeping woman. Gaz from the YouTube channel Grizzly Gaz loves the outdoors and has dedicated his videos to documenting his frequent camping trips in the countryside of England, along with his cute little French bulldog, Fendi. Oh, cute? This time Gaz travels deep into a remote forest that is... Tinan yung forest nila, oh. Diba? Ang ganda sana eh. Diba, oh. Sobrang ganda ng itsura niya, parang nasa ibang lugar ka talaga eh. Pero... Isipin mo ang creepy pero, di ba, nakaka-amaze. Nakaka Said to be haunted by the quote, Lady in White. The Whoa. story goes that back in the 1800s, a troubled woman who lived on a farm at the edge of the woods was so distraught that she took her own life amongst the trees of the forest. Gaz says that he has heard the story, but he doesn't really seem all that bothered. So Gaz just sets up his hammock and prepares to spend the night in the deep woods. However, when the sun goes down, something happens that makes Gaz wish he had never come to this particular forest. Sino ba naman kasi matutulog dyan? Tanginan naman. Hello? Gagin daw makakatulog dyan Gagin, nakatakot uh, yung ano boses Hello? Iyak sa ano, no? Pati yung aso, uh, ano eh, namamangha eh, natatakot eh. Hello. Ang problema nito, paano ka ngayon uuwi? Nagahanap na yung aso eh, oh. No, I'm off, mate. I'm off. 
And with that, Gaz has had enough. He quickly packs up his hammock, gathers his things, oh, and yeah. just gets out of there. Gaz is shocked by the horrible noises that sound exactly like a crying woman. He believes that he might have captured the troubled spirit of the woman who took her own life centuries ago in the haunted forest. Even little dog Fendi appears to be on edge about their creepy surroundings. She seems to keep staring at something in the woods that Gaz just can't see. So did outdoorsman Grizzly Gaz accidentally capture evidence of the paranormal? I leave that up to you to decide. You can watch this entire creepy video over on the YouTube channel, Grizzly Gaz, A Leopard Inn. Pag minaiyak kang narinig sa ano, dito, pag galang dito sa bahay, di ba? Pagka, for example, sa bahay nyo, nakakatakot na, lalo pa sa gubat. Nearly 300 years ago, in the early 1700s, the Leopard Inn and Pub was built in the thriving town of Burslem, England. The inn was a huge success, and people from all over would visit to stay the night or to have a few pints in the downstairs pub. However, the Leopard's Inn's history is also marred by many tragic events. One of the most notable episodes in the inn's dark history is the violent passing of a lady of the night in one of the upstairs rooms. Her life was taken by an angry and very violent customer. It is said that both of their spirits are trapped inside the Leopard Inn, doomed to wander its halls for all eternity. Visitors and workers at the inn claim to have had terrifying experiences with one of these spirits. Some say that the dark shadowy figure of a man follows and attacks people at the end, sometimes touching or pushing them, or even grabbing them by the throat. So what's one of the most scariest experiences that you've had inside the Leopard Inn Hotel? That is the figure, a black figure that goes upstairs, um, wanders through the pub, opens and closes doors, um, sometimes get touched on the shoulder. And have you actually seen the figure? Yes. Over the years, the inn's business took a sharp downturn and much of the structure was sealed off and left abandoned until 2007. The Leopard Inn's first floor is now a historic pub, but the upper floors and rooms of the inn still remain empty and in a state of decay. Ghost Hunters Jeff and Phil from the YouTube channel Ghost Tech Paranormal Investigations travel to the Leopard Inn with their cameraman Pete. They hope to catch supernatural activity on camera, and what they encounter is truly chilling. The team installs several static cameras throughout the inn, and then they start to explore. Almost immediately, they capture something unexplainable in the second floor hallway. It was really cold behind me as well. Yeah, I've just, I've just gone yeah, cold. Did you feel that? Yeah, I felt it. Where did it come from, Pete? Big gas. Oh, creepy. Did you see it? Hallway, right? It came into my bag from there. Oh, crap. I'm scared. Something's moving down that way as well. Yeah, and there's something things. moving. Bring your K2 in here, Jeff. A lot of cold air came into my bag from there. Something's moving down that way as well. After hearing the bizarre unexplained footsteps, the Ghost Tech team continues to investigate in hopes of finding the source of the mysterious sound. Now, this is when Phil starts to experience some very strange and creepy encounters. The first time it happens, Phil is on the third floor, conducting a spirit box session. Ito, spirit box. Gusto gusto to ni Pete Atena Galientes. Is there anybody here in this hallway at the moment? Okay. Ito yung hotel. Napaka-creepy. Uh, okay. Yeah, on my hood. Okay, that's good. Yep. Yeah. Okay, so I take it you are with us. Phil just laughs off the tug on his coat. But then it happens again. Gago, the old bit. Um, Phil. Yeah. Hold on a sec. I'm creepy to Calbo. You see, when you said someone touched you. Yeah. 
Did you laugh? No. Whoa, bit too bad. Something touched me. As Phil gets touched, I clearly hear a man laugh, and this is captured on our digital recorder. Here's the audio enhanced. <laughs> I was told that you were seen walking up and down the stairs. I was told that you were seen walking up and down the stairs. A dark figure seems to reach out towards Phil, almost as if it's attempting to grab him again. Meanwhile, one of the upstairs cameras has caught something that is downright chilling. Whilst we are on the second floor, at the same time our static night vision camera on the third floor is capturing what seems to be an apparition. It stands at the end of the hallway, then it turns and walks into a room. Here's the footage followed by the footage enhanced. I put ya. Kago to mga to na katagot ah. A white translucent figure can be seen entering one of the bedrooms on the third floor. So, could this be the spirit of the man that terrified so many visitors at the inn? And is it the same figure that was reaching out to Phil? You can watch this entire two-part investigation over on the YouTube channel, Ghost Tech Paranormal Investigations. The End of the Zark Haunting Ito inaantay ko. Now you might remember a little while back we featured an Indian family who claimed that their apartment was haunted by a poltergeist. Could you please drop? Whoa, 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 whoa. Well, as an update to this story, the father Zark says that he has decided to end the channel because Aba? now his family has finally moved to a new home. <laughs> but Zark posted one final video from their old apartment that might be their creepiest video yet. Whoa! Zark hears a child crying in their living room and thinks that it's his son. But just as he enters the room, he sees a semi-transparent child run toward the hall. In the dark, Zark can't tell that something just doesn't quite look right. And he runs after the child, thinking that it's his own son. But just then, his wife yells to him from the other room to say that their son is still safe in bed, snug Lo. under the covers and not crying at all. Lo. So Zark has no idea who or what this is. Cut back to current day and Zark ta -ta, says that the channel is now over. But was the Zark scary haunting channel for real? Or was it all just an elaborate hoax? You decide.
Oi, may extra pa? Ayo ko na. God, Tako ta ko. Eh. May extra pa? Already, user that goes by the name failed talk show host lives with his girlfriend in a small apartment in Denver, Colorado. Sometimes the couple hears strange noises in their apartment, but they never really thought much of it. That is until the Reddit user buys a brand new Samsung phone with a new night mode feature, meaning that the phone can take vivid, highly optimized photos even in the dark. He decides to try out the feature, so he turns off all the lights and snaps a few photos around his apartment. When he looks back at the results, he is shocked to see an unfamiliar figure standing in the kitchen mm. cupboard. Ito lang pala to, nakita ko na to. Confused and worried, the user posts his photo to Reddit to get opinions on what he could have captured. After many requests, the Redditor decides to leave a camera recording overnight as he and his girlfriend sleep. When the couple reviews the recorded footage the next day, they discover something absolutely terrifying. Bago. Someone or something can be seen moving around in the dark, and whatever it is looks very similar to the figure in the previous photo. So could it be that their apartment is haunted? Or just what is this? Let eh, me know what you think. Tang, ina, 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 Thanks for watching, ako. I know I'm- Ah, yun to to. Ang galing talaga ng looks to. Oo nga, kamukha nga ni John Wick. <laughs> Ang galing talaga ng looks, grabe. Anong pangalan nung ano? Teka lang. I came from the mud There's dirt on my head